Hello, tournament friends and followers. We're back for more States Against Humanity. Tonight, we're going to travel into the Hellscape Dystopian Division so that we can visit number two seed, Florida. Also, from here on out, I will be referring to this as the March Sadness Tournament, and I'm really upset that I didn't think of that. Thank you, Maddie. Obviously, Maddie is more clever than I am, so you all should go follow him. But back to Florida. Governor Ron DeSantis signs a law into effect banning unhoused people from sleeping in public spaces. Once enacted, this law would have localities move unhoused people into tent cities far away from these public spaces. Because as it turns out, apparently it's hard to enjoy your crumble cookie while someone is sleeping outside because they don't have a home. Politicians like Ron DeSantis are concerned that seeing people sleep in encampments like this will make them think twice about paying 85% markup on their overpriced restoration hardware furniture. Meanwhile, they continue to avoid the problem that is homeowner insurance in the state of Florida, which is like three to four times what it is nationwide. Representative Jared Mosquist has actually tried to tackle this, this problem and has put forward a bill last May, which the House has done absolutely nothing with. But no, you better believe we're not going to let people who don't have houses have anywhere to sleep unless it's where we say they can sleep. Perhaps more concerning about the bill is the fact that this would be left up to the localities. So if you know anything about the counties in Florida, specifically in this genre here, yeah, you know who you are. Also, uh, these guys exist there. So I feel like I've made my point. Join me tomorrow as we discuss more of the dystopian hellscape division and look at number one seed Alabama and why, despite the fact that their congressional makeup looks like this, they despise diversity and inclusion. It's a real mystery.